not going to be a full-fledged video, but I reckon an interesting comparison between standard SATA hard drives. This one is a something 250 gig dead. This one is out of our server and is a I think it's a four, 146 gig. But being server, it's 15,000 RPM and uses a sort of a SCSI SATA equivalent. As is noted, serial attached SCSI. So yeah, I thought the SCSI protocol was dead. Not quite. So, if we pop off the covers, attempting to do it by one hand, ow. We have your standard sort of modern internal hard drive layout. Da -da -da. Super duper strong magnets, you've got your arm actuator with the read right heads on, and of course your lovely disc with platinum, and a nice fast rotational motor. Popping off this, of the 15,000, interesting layout. Now you've still got your same basic layout, but... You've got some of the strongest, ne in fact, the strongest neodymium magnets I've ever found in a hard drive. Little itty witty tiny discs. Now my guess as to why the discs are so small is to do with rotational, f rotational forces. You know, if you rotate something like that at 15,000 RPM, you're going to get a lot of kinetic energy stored up. This means less kinetic energy but you do need more platters for the storage because you've got less surface area the little head can scan and of course stronger magnets mean this head is going to operate at much higher speeds itself I don't know whether this drive is dead I don't have anything that can do this kind of SCSI protocol so these are parts interesting design differences I'm not quite sure why this is this thick. I don't know whether it's to do with shielding in case these things explode, which I've never known a hard drive to do, so I doubt it's that. Or if it's just to make it fit this particular standard so they've just made it nice beefy. It's interesting nonetheless. And I just thought an interesting comparison between server serial SCSI and the old serial instead of IDE interface that we now have and well getting into solid state hard drives you might as well just look at a standard memory board to be honest thanks for watching hope that was interesting highlight anything else in knowledge you have about the differences between these